On my way into the gym, we are heading to Raleigh, North Carolina today. Oh yeah, yeah, that is today. I'm posting this tomorrow. Got a, I almost confused myself. I'm about to do 45 minutes of cardio. I know for sure that this will be a very intense. How you doing? This will be a very, uh, I'll be eating a lot of bad foods this weekend. So for that reason, I'm going to up my cardio today and tomorrow. And that leads to what I want to talk about today in this video. Your cardio amount, matter of fact, wait, I'll, I'll talk to you some more when I get on on the uh, cardio machine. A lot of my clients, they ask me like, how do I know how much cardio to do? And I usually advise people to do cardio based on how tight your macros are, meaning how disciplined are you with your with, with your food intake? If you're, if you're eating healthy foods 90% of the time, 95% of the times, healthy foods, um, and you're in a caloric deficit, for most of your days, I want to say six out of seven of your days, then you don't need to do a whole bunch of cardio. But you also need to, to learn to work around your cheat days or your cheat meals. So for instance, I'm going out of town this weekend and I know I'm gonna be around family. It's gonna be a birthday party. So I'm gonna up my cardio. I'm gonna make sure I do about 45 minutes of cardio a day to kind of prevent the caloric surplus from being too extreme. And this helps me maintain my weight. And that's where I'm, what I'm doing right now. I'm just maintaining. I'm not trying to really lean out right now. So you have to do your cardio based on one, how you eat, two, your specific goals. And just make the mental switch because a lot of us, we do cardio just because we're trying to lose weight but you gotta think about the cardiovascular benefits as well and that's the real reason to do it if you know you're gonna be eating bad do more cardio another thing i want to leave with you guys treat cardio with the same theory that we treat weightlifting like when weightlifting is about progression slow and steady progression make sure that you're progressing in your cardio as well i'm out of breath i had to slow this thing down um set set number goals for instance if you do the stairs like me set total steps goals for a particular amount of time and then next time you get on the machine try to beat that amount of steps in that given time so for instance if you do 1,800 steps in 25 minutes, next time you get on, try to do 1,810 steps in 25 minutes. And then progress, each session, progress. I know for me, setting these kind of number goals, it keep me focused, it holds me accountable. So I hope that helps you. Let me get back to this work. I'm so happy that's over. I think now we gotta go pick up the, the rental car. So we just got to Hertz. Like there's a pancake place across the street that has unlimited pancakes for $3.95. Please keep me away from there. What's up boss? Yeah baby. Pita, Piper, pick up. So we in the Chevy Sonic. Even got levis bluetooth uh-huh how you feel i feel fancy so when we go on road trips a big way that i prevent myself from eating crazy is that i bring my food because i know for one thing i'm not going to waste any food if i bring it so this kind of helps it's one of those little things that helps me stay focused while i'm on the road let me give you guys some insight. I know you guys like insight, right? This video editing thing, first of all, I never edited videos in my life prior to starting this, this vlog or this channel. And I, I'm self-taught. So my first video took me three days to edit. Anyway, long story short, these videos probably take me about two to three hours to, to edit and post. And I'm usually doing it late at night, real early in the morning, on road trips. 
So when you guys comment, like, and subscribe to the channel, like that means so much to me because I put so much time and energy into creating these videos and editing them and thinking of different stuff to to actually um, film for you guys. So. I appreciate you guys, everyone who supports the channel, everyone who comments, like I said, that's like the best sort of payment for me, so keep it up. That's Kazo's house. Hey man. What's up, man? I was, I was dozed off. What's, What's up, up, man? Good to see you, man. Likewise. What's up, Chris? Nice to meet you. Candice. Oh, it's a shirt. What's up, man? How you doing? Oh, you good? Man, I live in another world. Oh. I know how that day is. The middle of the day, the of the day naps. You're in the pool. Mm -hmm. You have fun at the pool, Chris? Mm-hmm. Yeah. I play with this boy and I play with my dad. Your new girlfriend? Nerf, Nerf gun. gun. You yeah. need a hand get, getting them dressed down? That one with the yellow seat. Yeah. Well, I, for you. I can lower the seat. Too. I was telling the last time when you came to Virginia Beach, when we went for a quick ride, I'm like, yeah, them, them bikes are just different. They fast, ain't they? They fast, yeah. I've never ridden a road bike. You ridden a road bike before? Mm -mm. Oh man, they fast. So we just wrapped up a uh, 20 mile? 19. 19 mile bike ride. That was that was really good, man. It was some intense hills. We seen some snakes. What's up, little fella? What's your name? Kenneth. What's your name? Kenneth. Kenneth. Nice to meet you, bro. That was good. You said what? Oh, they call you TJ. You said your name is Kenneth, but they call you TJ? Oh, where did TJ come from then? So baby Cuz over here tearing down some cinnamon rolls and these uh, exotic flavor Pop-Tarts. And we eating this food. I just had a salad. That thing is gone right now. Some of this chili is real good. And then we got um, red potatoes, um, chicken breast, and we put some salsa on it. Do you want this? Everything we traveled with. Now, this works for me because I'm you not going to... travel with me. No, no, no. I'm talking about the food, bro. This works for me because I know I'm not going to waste the food. So if I have the food, I'm going to eat the food. And if I don't have food, I'm going to probably eat bad food. She wanted to... Where's, where's this place? Some burger place she talking about? Yarborough. Yarborough's. No, we're not going to Yarborough's. We're eating... Here, here, burrows. Oh, come on, Troy, don't bad, do it, bad. man. <laughs> don't do it, brother. So I'm gonna go visit my cousin, Renaud. I, this is like one of my closest cousins when I was a kid. Um, this this vlogging thing is just, it can be a, a challenge sometimes because it's like I won't be knowing what to say. Cool story, bro. I'm going to my cousin's house. <laughs> cool story, bro. <laughs> I know a cool story. Yeah, I'm going to my cousin's house. Whatever. I'm going to my cousin's house. My man TJ with the Fresh J's. You watch YouTube? You don't watch YouTube? What kind of kid are you? That's right, boy. I like you, kid. My man said, I don't watch YouTube like that because I'm usually outside. Good. I like that. Okay. That was the best answer ever. Ever. That's how our kids are going to be. You don't watch it like that. That's what I just said. Oh. Let the bugs in. Come on. Oh. 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 Oh.
Oh, 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 oh. What's up, bro? Uh, CJ. I saw a video. You seen a video? Of me. You seen one of my videos? Mm-hmm. Hello. Oh, how are you? We, we went What's going on, bro? Yeah, so how you doing? Oh, I'm good. Why are you so big? You look just like him. No, you don't. What? Yep. Lord have mercy. Yeah, Dr. Miguel. You make videos. Yeah, I do make videos. Um, I like your hair. <laughs> they really pulled up the video though. <laughs> no! You don't want to be in the video? I do! Oh, I, I do! Alright, do a dance. <laughs> <laughs> I, I can do a dance. Alright, do a dance. Okay. There we go. Oh, oh. Hey, hey, hey. Yo, that's the coolest thing I've ever seen. We are old. Yeah. We got in and out, and now we're back home, we're about to get ready for bed. Cause that's where we like to be, at home in the bed. Leaping on my pillow. Leaping on her pillow and not jumping. Leaping means sleeping. Oh. <laughs> in Cami language. <laughs> yeah. Oh, baby. Baby bricks. bricks. Hey. Dang, that thing looks huge. Can you get it in there? Holy triceps. Yeah, it's in there, cuz. Anyway, we're just trying to share the wellness with you guys it's as always. So get well. Wash your butt. And get money. I just forgot to throw that in there. I'm gonna watch my butt right now. <laughs>